secure moment where both, where, where particularly Tesla and SpaceX are really growing in lots of ways right now. Um, and you've had plenty of ups and downs even at this point, but, but, but it's a high point. On your own journey in this way, what are the biggest mistakes you've made that you've learned from? Because you, you talk a little bit about being willing to put yourself out there, fail, learn, keep growing. What were turning points for you that really you, you, you said, wait a minute, this is wrong or this is the wrong move either personally or, or for the company and that, that, that you learned from that it's led to where you are right now? Well, if I had to list all the mistakes, this would be a very long call. Um, so it's too, too many to even think of. I'm trying to think, like, how, how, could, I, how could I classify them in some way? Um, um, well, I mean, some of the things I mentioned just before, it's like, where, you know, I was recommending that people spend less time in a, in a conference room, less time getting presentations and, and spreadsheets, and that, like, generally that's like when, when when I have spent too much time in a conference room, that's generally when things have gone awry. And when I go and spend time on the factory floor, um, or you know, really using the the, the, the cars, um, thinking about the rockets, it's like that's where things have gone gone better. Um, that, but does that does that risk? Some some people would worry that that risks sending a message to your your teams that you personally have to be involved in some of the work that you can't delegate or, or you can't trust them. I think that's one thing that makes some, you know, executives reluctant. They're trying to find that line between showing their personal commitment and trusting their subordinates to do the work. So, yeah, I mean, you're, you're known for being passionate, sleeping the back and floor, and, but, 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 but yeah, is that a concern for you or do you not care? Is, 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 that's not an issue for you, right? Are you, how, how do you think about it? Well, there's a lot of talented people at SpaceX and Tesla, um, and I think the morale is, is good. Um, uh, I, for sure, respect them greatly, and it's an honor to work with them. Um, and I find that if, if I am um, engrossed in the details of, of the issues, this does not result in them feeling better, but worse, they're feeling better. Like, they're, they're in my experience, more energized. Um, you know, it's like, you know, talking about like war, it's like do you want the general in some like you know ivory tower or, or on the front lines. Like what, troops going to the troops are going to fight a lot harder if they see a general on the front lines than if, if they think generals you know in some cushy situation. So it's like <clears throat> nobody bleeds the prince in the palace. Get out there on the gun front line and, and, and you know show them that you you care and, and that you, you're not just in some plush office somewhere. Um, yeah, I'm in my plush office right now, actually. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, my office here. Um, let, 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 let's talk quickly about Tesla. Um, but both Tesla and SpaceX are scaling up today. In fact, I mean Tesla touched 600 billion, I think, yesterday in valuation. Today you said you're going to raise five billion through new stock sales. Um, I assume, and, and I assume what those gains are really in your mind going to do is help you scale up faster, be poured back into investment. Because now is the moment to do that. Is that the plan here? Yeah, I mean, I, I guess this. Um, you know, we're, we're kind of debating like should we raise money or should we not? Um, it wasn't like a hundred percent sure thing. Um, in the end, we thought, well, we can retire a lot of the debt and uh, increase the security of the company. Well, probably a good thing. Uh, and for less than one percent of solutions, probably makes sense. Um, but we're, you know, neither here, here nor there on that. I think it's a uh, could have gone either way. So what is so the money's for really debt retirement? You said today. Uh, debt retirement and like I guess to have a bit more of a war chest, or you know. Um, I guess at the end of the day, you know, what, what is money? Money is an entry in a database. Okay, I want to take a couple questions uh, from the audience. First, I want to go to a video question uh, that we solicited. Um, uh, if we could play that. Um. Hello, my name is Catherine Parsons, and I'm the CEO of technology education company Decoded. I want to know, are machines able to innovate, or is innovation an inherently human capability? 